Hey friends, and welcome back to No Skinny Jeans. It's been almost three weeks since my last video. And you may be asking, where have you been? What have you been doing? What's been going on? Um, I became a dad for the second time. That's been the focus. Um, you know, Lauren had a awesome C-section, did well, and then ended up with an infection. So I have to make sure she's okay. Spending time with Everett, making sure, you know, we're <laughs> taking care of him. And of course, making sure Ella feels no different uh, with be having her brother here and she has adjusted well. Um, just this past Friday, I actually took her, just her and I, uh, to go get ice cream, which by the way, I did not get your name and I apologize for that. <laughs> Was not thinking clearly, had no sleep, but one of the people that works at the local Dairy Queen where we went to have ice cream, uh, recognized us and said that she watches and that Everett was actually born on her birthday. So thank you uh, for the hospitality and everything. I really appreciate it. want to share with you guys everything that's been going on and making sure that I am upfront forthcoming with everything. So like I said, Everett was born on the 25th of February and since then it has been a whirlwind. It doesn't feel like it's been three weeks, honestly. He was born, so my focus was on him, and then Lauren ended up, like I said, with an infection, and so of course the focus shifts to her. I have to drive to every appointment and all of that. I still got in exercise whenever I could, but that and diet definitely have suffered during these last three weeks. I don't believe I have ballooned up to an astronomical weight or anything like that or gained a bunch of weight. I mean, I'm still obviously heavy, where I last left you, it was about 291. If I had to make a prediction, which I'm gonna get on the scale here later on, if I had to make a prediction, I'm probably close to 300, if I had to guess. I haven't weighed myself or done any of that. The scales kinda of just sat there tormenting me. But if I had to guess, that's about where I'm at. The reason I didn't film or do anything like that, I didn't feel it would be fair to you um, when I'm not in control of my diet, things like that. We had a lot of people that cooked for us, amazing food. Thank you so much to everyone who cooked for us. You know, we did quick meals sometimes. There was fast food involved, things like that. You know, it's when you're not in control and there wasn't any time to be in control of that, honestly. And that's okay. That's part of being a dad growing up. Be, you have to be selfless as a father. You have to, your focus is your family, not yourself at times. Plan going forward is to definitely focus on going to the gym when after Ella's in school, at least giving myself an hour or so. I've come up with a weightlifting plan that I've drawn up um, that I wanna do and as well as cardio. So I'm happy to be back on that track and focused in that direction. Another quick update too, uh, Miss Mom over here has lost almost 40 pounds since giving birth on the 25th. She's cheating, she's breastfeeding, so I can't keep up with that, unfortunately. But to everyone that gave her crap when, gave me crap, I should say, when she was pregnant and I was losing weight, well, now it's reversed. She's not pregnant anymore, she's losing weight, and I think I'm gaining a little. So we're gonna get it on track. But yeah, other than that, those have been my focuses. I mean, the people that have been here know my upbringing, things like that. And my main focus when my children were born, uh, the first time I held them, actually, I, I told them. Not that they'll remember, obviously, I know that, but it's kind of for myself, selfishly, that they are my focus. I will protect them and be there for them as long as I can. And obviously being healthier is a part of that. We're definitely gonna make sure that we take care of ourselves as well as take care of our family. Without further ado, I'm gonna go ahead and weigh in, show you where I'm at, and we'll talk a little bit after that, and then I'll introduce you to uh, the newest family member. All right, guys, here we go. I'm gonna step on the scale and we'll see where we're at, yeah. Hey. All right, here we go. Get the scale. I'm a little nervous, we'll see. I'm holding the camera on top of it, so that's not gonna help. There we go. All right, guys, and just as I figured, right at uh, almost 300, we're at 299.8. We're still under 300, so small success, but um, that does mean that I did gain since the last weigh-in of 291, uh, and that was on, not even sure the date, I could look back at the videos, but um, 
we'll just say for quick reference, we'll say it was three weeks. So in those three weeks, I gained about 8.2 pounds. Um, 8.8 8 .8 pounds, actually, if I could do math. That is what it is. We're going to step up to the plate and we're going to do better. So 299.8 will be the new starting weight. I'll write that down uh, as soon as I get a chance here. And we'll go from there. So overall, that means I'm actually right at 100 pounds lost um, since I started this journey. And that's exactly what it is, a journey. Sometimes you gotta step away, take a rest, and focus on life. My kids are doing great. Ella's thriving, which is beyond awesome. Um, we've, de we've dedicated Fridays that we're going to go out and do things uh, with her. I'm really proud of her. You know, making sure Everett's good, which all he does is eat, sleep, poop. You know, that's newborn life. You know, Lauren will be joining me on this and joining in as soon as she's cleared by the doctor. She has another couple weeks, I do believe, uh, six weeks until she can do some physical activity such as walking longer distances. We've done a few things, went on some short walks, things like that, and she's been awesome. She's a trooper. So we know where we're starting. We know where we want to go. And without further ado, let me introduce the little man that has joined us. Say hi everybody. Oh, you hold on. Let me get him. Hi, Dad. I can... <laughs> He's sleeping. But yeah, he just actually finished eating, woke up, and obviously that falls under. He ate, he's sleeping, so logically that means he's gonna poop sometime. Can I say something? No. Okay. I'm kidding. <laughs> John's being way too hard on himself. You are have done amazing and you've supported me so much through like healing and stuff. Yeah. And it's only fair that I lose weight now and Can't you see you. Weight. you. Gotta bend down a little more there. It's only fair that I'm losing weight and that I, you gained I, a tiny amount. I am not jealous of you gaining or gaining, losing weight at all. I'm proud of you actually. I'm proud of you, you've done awesome. But yeah, we have, I have a mission and I know what I have to do to get there so. We're gonna start focusing on that. We're so proud of John. Watch, watch, this. okay, good job. <laughs> Guys, thank you all for the support. Uh, I know I've been gone for quite a few weeks there, but I appreciate everything. We appreciate you. Remember, I, I didn't forget, we got this. Bye friends, thank you for being here.